In this lesson we'll go through the basis of vectors. What are vectors? Vectors are a way of handling behavior in three dimensions. As we live in a three-dimensional universe, vectors are the natural language of physics. Almost every part of physics, from the basics at first up to the most advanced superstring theories, use vectors. In this course, we'll use them quite a lot, starting off with simple vectors in motion, ending up with vector field and electricity and magnetism. As you go further on in the course, you'll learn more about more complicated vector fields and tensors and things like that, culminating in things like general relativity, where this is all fundamental. So this is a first step in a long road. Now we know some of you will have done vectors at school, some won't. You will be doing them in maths. But in this set of videos, we'll give you a reminder of the key points to help you build a foundation for what goes on. Some terminology. Something is a vector, you indicate it, say V as a vector, by putting an arrow over the top. You draw a vector and a diagram as an arrow. The length shows you how strong it is, and the direction shows you the uh, direction that the vector points. The length of a vector is shown by putting vertical lines on both sides of a vector. So that's telling you what the length from there to there is. That's This is the vector v, and that's the length of the vector v. And it's indicated as the modulus, or the magnitude, of the vector, and that means the length of it. So, for example, this vector and this one point in the same direction, but this one has a larger magnitude, whereas this vector has a shorter magnitude, even though it points in the same direction. Now, sometimes you want to show the direction of a vector but don't care about the length. In that case, you use a unit vector, and that's written with a little cap over the top of it. That's a vector of length 1 in a particular direction, so that length is always 1, and it just indicates the direction, and because they all have length 1, you don't care about the length. So a vector, its magnitude, and unit vector.